Hi guys, thanks for tuning in. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe by clicking the button below. Enjoy. Hello and welcome to Katie Picks. Today we are making a ridiculously naughty little treat for ourselves in the microwave. I've done a few little microwave recipes for you now. I will make sure I link them all into a playlist. Playlist? Playlist. Playlist right up here, so make sure you go and check them out. But today, I, I I don't care that it's January and we're all doing healthy eating. I want a treat and I want it really, really quickly so no one else notices that I've had it. That's the sort of treat I'm talking about. And we're gonna do a cookie in the microwave in under one minute. So one minute microwave chocolate chip cookie. How does that sound? Should we get going? Let's do this. Disclaimer, one minute, less than one minute cooking time will make take you more time to measure out the ingredients. Okay, should we get going? Okay, let's do this already then. So first thing first, we're gonna put a tablespoon of butter into a microwavable cup, and that's gonna go into our microwave for about 10 seconds just to melt. You do not want to see your butter boiling. Just melted, thank you very much. So it should only need about 10 second blasts. I've got a very cheap microwave. <laughs> very helpful if you have a digital microwave. But otherwise I'm gonna do a lot of this by eye, so bear with me. Great, yeah, perfect. Okay, so our butter is melted. It has not boiled at any point though. It is just melted. That's perfect. To that, we're going to add one tablespoon of dark brown sugar. Oh my goodness. We're then going to add one tablespoon of granulated sugar. That's important because we want the coarse texture in our cookie. We're then gonna add in a pinch of salt. And we're also gonna add in some vanilla extract. Now, if you've got vanilla extract, just use a teaspoon. I've got proper vanilla paste here. So I'm going to add in half a teaspoon of the good stuff. Oh, stop. oh it's so good. Ah, ah. And we're going to give that a really good stir to make sure all of your sugar and your butter is combined. To that, we're going to add one egg yolk. Let me grab a bowl. So just the yolk of our egg this time. So we're going to let the white run out. And you can always save this and make yourself a little meringue. Or if you are being healthy this January, make yourself an uh, egg white omelette. So in with the egg yolk. Going to give that a good mix up. Lovely. So we should have a nice, well-mixed, but still quite runny mixture at this point. We're now going to go in with our thickener, which is our plain flour. And I've got three tablespoons of plain flour going into this. And we're going to stir that most of the way through. And just before we finish, we're going to add in our chocolate chips. We just don't want to over stir our chocolate chips because otherwise we could start melting them. And I want a nice solid chocolate chip in my chocolate chip cookie. In we go. And give that a final stir as well. So what you are left with now is essentially a cookie dough mixture. <laughs> This is going to go into our microwave on its highest setting for 40 to 60 seconds. I recommend taking it out at about 40, checking it. What you're looking for is a nice firm cookie, but it shouldn't be tacky on top. actually have to eat raw cookie dough. I'm okay with that. <gasps> it's perfectly fine. Oh, that should be 40 seconds. I'd say it should be firm at this point, but tacky on top. Yeah. Look at it. It's a cookie in a cup. Now just picture this, you've just got home from work, it's been dark when you left for work, it's dark when you get in from work. You just want a little bit of comfort, something to make your heart happy. You notice there's some ice cream, do you know what would be amazing with ice cream? A 
hot, freshly baked cookie. Scoop of ice cream on top of that bad boy. I'm gonna tuck in, and what you've got here is like the sort of soft cookie. Oh, it's hotter than the sun. Oh, proper home baked cookies. That is delightful. I really hope you give this a try. So simple. I love microwave recipes. If this appeals to you, please let me know in the comments box below. Also, your recipe suggestions are always welcome and actively encouraged, so please get them in there too. Make sure you subscribe. I'm here every single Tuesday doing new recipes. On a Friday, I vlog and all the usual. Please follow on social media at the Katie Cooks, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You know the drill. Until next time, guys. Love you lots. It's just a cookie and a cup. It's a cup of cookie. A cup of cookie.